Hi, my name's Tad Schuchter. I'm here at the GM Heritage Center today to talk about the all new seventh generation Corvette. I'm the Corvette Chief Engineer and I am really proud to be able to present today. It's been almost six years to the day we're introducing the seventh generation car. In thinking about what to call it, we can think of nothing better than to use the hallowed name, the revered name in the auto industry, the Corvette Stingray. The seventh generation Corvette Stingray is the most powerful, most capable standard Corvette we've ever introduced. The new small block V8 produces at least 450 horsepower and 450 foot-pounds of torque. That's able to accelerate the car to 60 miles an hour in under four seconds. It also corners at over 1G. Not only is this the quickest standard Corvette we've ever produced for the track, it'll actually be quicker than today's Corvette Grand Sport. The new Corvette's interior is probably the most upgraded single area of the car. We really focused on premium execution and making it a world-class sports car driving environment. It uses very premium real materials like carbon fiber, premium leather, real uh, metallic accents and aluminum. Everything was designed to make the driving experience better. It also looks fantastic and uses the latest technology and information displays. One of the things we focused on the interior is things that the driver touches. The seat is super important. It's your connection to the vehicle. We have an all new seat designed ground up, has a magnesium frame for light weight. We have actually two different seats, one more suitable for long distance touring and a competition sports seat that's appropriate for the track. Each one has been specifically tailored for excellent comfort and then the right amount of support for the job. They also look fantastic. One of the great things about the Corvette Stingray is that it can be used for a lot of different purposes. It can be used for a daily driver, a long distance tourer, or a cutting edge performance machine on the track. It has excellent luggage room, good long distance comfort, and because people use the car in so many ways, we elected to do a driver mode select that really tailors all the controllable subsystems in the car to optimize them for each of those uses. The all new small block engine for the Corvette Stingray incorporates the latest in technologies, direct injection, variable valve timing, and cylinder deactivation. These enable the engine to be more powerful than ever and far more efficient than ever. Because of our advancements in carbon fiber applications, we're able to now offer carbon fiber panels on the standard Stingray. We're using it on the hood to take weight off the front end, and we're using it on the roof to bring the center of gravity down and make the removable roof easier to handle when taking it off the car. One of the critical advances on the new Corvette Stingray is in its aluminum structure. Today's structure is made out of steel. We've moved to 100% aluminum on Corvette to generate a frame that's almost 100 pounds lighter and yet 60% stiffer than today's vehicle. One of our goals in designing a new Corvette is not just to make it look different. We want to make it look different in ways that make it work better. We've taken the racing lessons learned from the track and we're applying them to the streetcar in a beautiful and seamless way. On behalf of the entire Corvette team, we are so proud to be introducing this car and we want everybody to learn as much about it as they can. If you want to learn more, go to Chevrolet.com.